Here's Carolina there wrote on Instagram. I like to use the word difference rather than conflict. Perhaps it says something about my preference, aware work. This is really an important question to me. Everybody knows conflicts is difficult and most people don't want conflict. It's rarely attractive. On the other hand, difference has a terrible reputation as well. For most people, difference is a threat. Difference is a betrayal. Difference will lead to a fight. Difference will uh, interfere with my uh, autonomy or difference will interfere with my connection. There aren't a lot of good things that people think about when they think about difference. The reality is, is that difference can be exciting. Difference can be useful and nourishing and connective. It is connective tissue. Two people can only touch and connect when they have difference. If there's no difference, it's just fusion, and you can't have connection when you can't tell one from the other. The relationship between difference and conflict is crucial. Conflict is when you try to get rid of difference by changing the other. When you get, try to get rid of difference by changing the other, the other typically pushes back. Now you have created conflict from difference. So difference is something that we support. When you're not trying to be changed by the other, then you can let the difference stand and you then have the opportunity to discover what's important about that difference to the other. What's the meaning of that? And to share the meaning of my side of the difference. So we can start collaboratively to look at what you need and want and what I need and want. And rather than adversarially trying to pull each other, we can look at the entire system, the whole system, and to look at what might be useful for both of us. There's not always a perfect solution. And sometimes there's just the shared sadness that we can't find anything that works well enough for both of us. That's on a minor level. At a macro level, if that's true, then we really are incompatible. And sad as it might be, because there is some loss, we're better off going apart than trying to act compatible when we're not.